I'm not going to be doing Resident Evil 4, I felt like doing Mega Man. Well, I hope you guys don't mind, I just really felt more like playing Mega Man this time. Nice, we're 12 minutes in and I haven't done jack Alright, last week I found a, a, a little chihuahua outside a general store that sells food and other stuff and grills meat on weekends so I, I me and my sister didn't have it on us we we grabbed the poor dog we were currently taking care of it until we find him a home or, or if he has owners hey starman you suck I remember him being better than this was he always this bad there we go wow that was easy Charge is also really powerful. All yeah, I can see that. You got Star Crash and Super Arrow. Nice, the Super Arrow is really good. It's like a makeshift rush yet. Oh man, it's so thirsty lately. Don't take that out of context, please. So yeah, uh, right now the little doggy is. He was sick when we grabbed him, like like a, with a cold. Right now he's fine after uh, after this week taking some medicine. Oh, we're fattening him. <laughs> Kill is killing stars. Indeed! Speaking of killing stars, let's now kill gravity. I'll, I'll kill destroy you, you and the night! But we can at least keep feeding him until he's all but fine and either try to find if he has owners because we believe he might have owners because his uh his na his nails were trimmed like with care. So it's like maybe maybe he got lost. Oh crap, that, that's going to be a bitch to grab, and yeah, but like what's man. This game, Mega Man 5, also some for some reason has a really high uh, one-up drop ratio from, from what I recall. Like that, for example. There we go. Oh, oh come on. We're almost there. There we go. Oh. <laughs> -da 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 -da. Yeah. I'm not alive. I tell you, Mega Man Five drops lives like it's nobody's business. Which I guess you could say Mega Man Five kind of feels like a pro Mega Man. I'll take it. Oh shit, this, this I, I remember this now. Yeah, it kind of feels li like Boomer Kuwanger's elevator, but this is much tighter to navigate through. Are the doors glitched? Like fa the first half of the tile set? Huh. <laughs> Do you now? They're kind of pathetic current today, Robot Masters, <laughs> in this game. Yeah, Gravity wrecks the Gyro Man really hard, he didn't even have a chance. I remember the Robot Masters from this game mainly because of the Ruby Stars cartoon. Like, I remember Crystal Man because of the episode The Mega Man on the Moon. Good. Cutman, Cutsman, time to ship out. Whatever you say, Crystal Man. But, yeah, I, I remember these guys mainly because of the cartoon and, and, Apple, and Apple Man because he, he only showed up in the opening and that was it. <laughs> Eddie, give me something good. Eddie gave me something good. Eddie gave me something good. Eddie give me a knee tank! Good lord Eddie. Eddie! 
heavy? <laughs> Give me a fucking heat tank already. Oh, motherfucker. He's trying. Oh, come on. Oh. Yeah, no heat tank for me. You know what I also remember a lot this game a lot for? Uh, I remember it a lot for for the Mega Man 5 parody in the webcomic Bob and George. Oh, I need tank, thanks. Kill me. Kill me. <laughs> and now we die again. <laughs> oh boy! Oh, there we go. Okay, let, let, let's do this level now. There we go. No, but, but I need that, Colonel. I need it to get beat because it's going to be useful for the final fight. Okay, now now <laughs> let's fight uh, the reason why Mega Man 5 is banned on the Vietnam. Yeah, but it's time to fight the war crime man, <laughs> indeed. By the way, apparently the child who designed Maple Man had a different name name in a different name in mind for him, like uh, Missile Man or something, and it was Capcom who renamed him into Napalm Man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, l let's, let's name our boss in our children's game even after a war crime, why not? Can't wait for Mustard Gas Man, <laughs> indeed! If I recall correctly, in the Mega Man Battle Network anime, he was renamed into Volcanic Man or something like that, or Volcanic Man, something like that. See, what did I tell you about the, about the one-ups in this freaking game? I'll take it, Eddie, I'll take it. Oh, Mega Man Star Force! Uh, the Mega Man Star Force games were pretty good in my opinion, it's just uh, Mega Man Star Force 2, um, the story is the issue, it has, it has a lot of missed potential in the story department, because it treats a very interesting subject, which is the O parts, the out of place artifacts, which are stuff uh, in real life too, artifacts that shouldn't exist in the time period they're apparently from. Um, but Mega Man Star Force 1 and Mega Man Star Force 3 are really good games in the story department and Mega Man Star Force 3 is when the series found its stride, its way to finally stand apart from Mega Man Battle Network, but by then it was too late. Yeah, too late because the interest on Mega Man had died a lot. People really hate... Uh, people really disliked... Uh, uh, Mega Man Star Force on release, some because they called it a simplified version of, of Mega Man Battle Network, and some because they didn't like Geo, the protagonist of Mega Man Star Force. But now that we know what Mega Man Battle Network 4's story will be like, now people want a Star, Star Force 4, now they do want Star Force. And people now are also rediscovering uh, Star Force 3 through emulation, uh, or R4s or whatever. Now people do realize uh, Star Force finally introduced many interesting mechanics. Yeah, it had a rough start, pretty much. Yeah, all, Me all Mega Man subseries except Mega Man X start really rough, but Star Force was the exception. It was rough in the first and second game. Uh, well, the second game mechanically it was sound. It was much better than the first game. It was, but because it's an, uh, an adventure RPG game. Uh, a weak story can harm it. Now I think it was this asshole who was weak to napal bombs. Base was more neutral than mine. I think Base became neutral after he lost his memory after the end of Battle Network 3, because in the Battle Network 5 through 6 he only was just looking for a challenge. He wasn't even spiteful about humanity anymore. He was just uh traveling around the internet. 
whatever, Eddie. Doesn't matter. Oh, <laughs> I'll have to redo this stage then. Uh, let me check the letters, the letters on my phone if I can. It was at the very beginning of the stage. <laughs> oh. Oh. oh, I see them. How how did I miss it? Okay, let, let's just do this stage as quickly as possible. Moments later. Hey guys, it's the predecessor to all the train stages in the rest of the Mega Man series, like a Slash Beasts or the train stages in Mega Man Zero. What? See what I told you about this game giving you so many lives? Supposedly the one in this stage is the easiest one to get, but I just need the rush call, so it should be on plain sight. Yeah, there we go, on plain sight. <laughs> okay, I'm starting to see some issues with the rush, new rush call. I I'm starting to see uh, where the problems with this rush call. What the hell? Yeah, it's really junk. Ooh, this is junk too. Power Stone is amazingly junk too. <laughs> I didn't remember Power Stone being that bad, I remember it being just a shield weapon. Oh! I, I think I should have used the freaking Mega Buster. Charge Kick. Ah, yes, the one weapon, the one classic weapon Copy X has. What I remember is that they used a set piece from this stage uh, for. Splash Woman's stage. Yes, this was a set piece they recycled for for Splash Woman in Mega Man 9. Yeah, the, this is a predecessor to the Ride Chaser stages from Mega Man X. Honestly, th this game really is a pro Mega Man X game. There's a glitch to actually do this part of the stage by walking instead of using this because it's solid ground. Where where is it? Oh, there we go. <laughs> wow! I got tense there for a moment. Kill me, I don't have much health, kill me. There we go. You got water wave. Okay, we got that and we got beat, so... It's time for the pro man stages. Yes, best theme in the game indeed. Oh man, I really don't like using this Jank Rush coil, but... It really is kind of Jank. Like, I see the logic behind it, but implementation... Uh, needed a bit a bit more coding. <laughs> now, they can, again, you can only do so much on an NES. Oh. I'll buy that for a dollar. Fuck those walkers. Oh no, please. <laughs> ah, I forgot about this. Oh, oh, oh. Fucking hell rush. That was Gucci. Fuck you. Oh. <laughs> 
Okay, Darkman 2. Um, does he do anything? What the f- I'll take it. There we go. <laughs> wow. Okay, so Power Stone actually works for something. <laughs> I don't know. I know, right? Ow. No, no. No. Okay, now 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 this this dude. Now now that's a dude that actually fights on like the previous previous one. Okay. Oh, right, he's Flashman. <laughs> Godsman makes me hard. Willy. Probably when designing his castle, so Godsman. I know, right? I'm surprised uh, the Battle Network version of Wily didn't make Godsman.exe. Okay, I think it's a final. Comfort my bird! Come on, beat! Kick his ass! Beat! Come on, beat! Kick his ass! Come on, beat! Come on, beat! Kick his ass! Come on, beat! Useless bird! If this were Dark Souls, you would have still won while the game was reloading LMAO. <laughs> really? That, that kept happening in Dark Souls? What, Links? You haven't played Dark Souls? In the future, I want to get a cheap capture clock card that actually takes HDMI, and I plan to play Dark Souls the Switch port. In the future. Maybe next year. There we go, Darkman is dead. Dark Souls is a game that's not well... Uh, it's 40% Yank. I can't take Yank, I mean... I play Mega Man... Kaboom. Well done, Mega Man! I never expected you to perfect my powerful Darkman robot! Until now I have managed to frame Pro Man for my crimes, but now the real Pro Man has appeared and spoiled my plan! Dr. Light is still capturing my lab, come if you dare! <laughs> I can't believe Dr. Wilfrido was guilty of this again. I can't believe, what a twist. Wow. Indeed, who could believe Wowie was involved in again? Oh, this is so good as a track. I don't doubt it. I'm just, just joking because of games like Mega Man, uh, Mega Man X7, for example. Then again, Mega Man X7 is bottom of the barrel garbage, so... You know what's the worst part? Because it's still the Mega Man X4 engine, Mega Man X6 te technically plays well, the problem is the level design. I'm glad there's the X6 tweaks patch now. Oh, what is the face of Einstein? <laughs> Indeed. And Dr. Light of Thomas Edison, which is funny because... I mean, yes, 
Einstein is, uh, did the nuke. But Einstein actually worked more f towards peace for mankind than Edison, which was kind of a jackass. <laughs> you know what? I'm going to kill myself to refill all my weapons. I'm at life zero, so might as well. Yeah, but Dr. Light is, is such a weird thing because uh, he's based on Edison and Santa Claus. Alright, let's recycle Dustman's gimmick. Why not? And I hate that this was the gimmick they chose to reuse for Mega Man X5 for Metal Shark Player's stage. Oh, wow, what? I'll take it! Ah, the legendary boss that glitched on James Rolfe he could beat without a knee. We shall cues. Finally, after much patience, I got the invisible pattern down and was able to destroy the boss. And that was a great moment in nerd history. That's impossible! Just one, just one lemon, just one lemon! Ah! Oh. I really am rusty at Mega Man. Oh. Thank you. Man, so many lives. <laughs> nice. Oh, why did I not heal? Okay. Barely remember that boss. I didn't remember this boss at all, Ty, to be perfectly honest. I thought it was going to be the giant met the boss, but no, that was in another game. In Mega Man 6, I think. Or no, Mega Man 4. Welcome to Filler! One eternity later. No! Oh yeah, this isn't the Wily Machine 5 yet, it's like just some presser piece of shit. With Nepal bomb from there. There we go. Okay. Let's do this fine now. Let's play it safe. I mean, it's the end of the game. Okay. <sighs> yes! Castrate him, Mega Man! You don't have to kill him, but castrate him! What is Yakas? This barefoot yakas. Yes! <sighs> of course. Oh. Of course. Verb, indeed. That's Mega Man 5! Oh man, it's it's great! I, I don't know why people hate it, but man, was it kind of kicking my ass there. Maybe because I'm too conservative with my E-Tanks, I could have spared a few more. Instead, I just kept myself at the max E-Tank. Uh, it's a very generous game with lives. As, as I said, having the chargeable Mega Buster kind of makes every boss doable without their weaknesses. So, it's also a good first Mega Man game for someone who wants to get in the series. I know I have to finish Resident Evil 4, and I will, but man, Mega Man is just my jam for these streams. It's the stuff I really enjoy playing. Shinichiro <laughs> Usek. Yeah, that, that kid, which is now an adult, it's probably 
personal than me. Apparently named Napalm Man someone something else, but Capcom named he named it renamed him uh, Napalm Man. So yeah, you always when in doubt name your robot after a Warframe. 